Here's example two of using a product to sum formulas to uh, rewrite products as sums or differences. So here we want to write the product as a sum or a difference, and the product is cosine of three theta times cosine of seven theta. So we want to go back to our formula sheet again, and if you want a copy of this, there's a link in the video description. You can click that link and get a copy of this. Uh, so here we have cosine of something times the cosine of something else. So that's going to be this product to sum formula here. Uh, cosine alpha times cosine of beta equals one half cosine alpha minus beta plus cosine alpha plus beta. So that's the formula we're going to use with uh, 3 theta as our alpha and 7 theta as our beta. Okay, So we're really just uh, plugging numbers into the formula, or numbers and variables and thetas and things like that into the formula uh, for now, and then we'll simplify and see what else needs to be done, if anything. So this is 1 half times, uh, open bracket, cosine of alpha minus beta, so that's 3 theta minus 7 theta, and then plus cosine of alpha plus beta, which is 3 theta plus 7 theta. Okay, because again, uh, alpha is 3 theta, beta is 7 theta. Okay, so now when we simplify, we have 1 half brackets cosine of 3 theta minus 7 theta is negative 4 theta. Then we have plus uh, 3 theta plus 7 theta is 10 theta. So plus the cosine of the 10 theta there. Okay. Now there's one more tiny thing we can do to simplify. So remember, cosine is an even function. So cosine of negative theta equals cosine of theta for every value of theta. Okay, so that, remember, that's what it means for cosine to be an even function. So here we have a negative 4 theta instead of just a negative theta, but the same exact principle still applies. Uh, cosine of negative 4 theta equals cosine of 4 theta. Okay. So um, now we can just rewrite this then without that minus sign in there. So that's a really nice property of even functions is that uh, cosine, uh, specifically in this case, cosine of negative some thing equals just cosine of that thing without the minus sign. Okay, so then this equals uh, one half, open bracket, cosine of four theta, and then plus cosine of 10 theta. And that's pretty much it. So uh, that's it for example two. Here's our answer, one half times the quantity cosine of four theta plus cosine of 10 theta. And that's uh, this product, cosine 3 theta, cosine 7 theta, rewritten as a sum of two different uh, trig functions here. Okay. So that's example two of using product to sum formulas to rewrite a product as a sum.